It felt like an epic battle was raging inside of me between my mind and my body. The part of me that hadn't been touched in nearly five years wanted to let him have his way, but my heart knew better. If I had sex with him now, I would only regret it later. Or would I? We can watch something else if you like, Garrett suggested. It's getting late. I think you should take me home. For a moment, we just sat there staring at each other. I could feel a tightness in my chest as the tension built. Would he be angry that I was rejecting him? I was certain few women ever had, probably none since he became rich. You don't like being touched, do you? He asked finally. Were we really going to get into this? No, I don't. Why not? For one, because I'm fat. And for two, I just met you. A short laugh escaped his lips. You really need to get some self-confidence. You're a strong, beautiful woman. Flattery will get you nowhere with me, Garrett, I warned. The laugh that escaped his lips this time was less than amused, an admission of his rejection. I apologize. He pulled his hand away. I thought there might be something between us. There was, until you put up the armrest. I tried to lighten the mood. Pissing off a multi-billionaire when I was locked inside his ridiculously large mansion probably wasn't the best idea. He didn't seem to find the joke funny. How long has it been since you've been with a man?